Well, what used to be a gritty industrial hideaway for artists is becoming more and more family friendly. Downtown's Arts District is changing, recently opening a park to accommodate its newer residents. Gil Reyes shows us. Three, two, one. Congratulations! It's amazing. This is a first city sponsored park in the Arts District. We're really excited to have it. It was a community driven design process, uh, which is exciting. And through that process, we were able to get a kid area, a performance area, get some murals here, some art areas for people to sit down, enjoy a cup of coffee, have something to drink, more green, more trees. And we got to do more of this because uh, this area is transforming. Downtown Councilman Jose Wezar describing LA's new arts district. Once a CD hidden gem for creative types is now booming with new residents and development. Apartments, restaurants, and startups are popping up, and expected soon, a pair of 58 story residential skyscrapers. Downtown LA is really becoming a lot more family friendly, so it's great to see a park like this open up where you can take your kids, your dog, just have a nice day. You know, this park was really on its deathbed just not too long ago. There was some designs for it, uh, but the money did not come through. Uh, we stepped in, provided $1.8 million, we moved some money around to make it a reality. Contaminated soil also delayed the park's opening, but it's all gone now. So are the days of cheap rent in the Arts District. To soften the blow of gentrification, the city reaches out to artists who remain. One way is to have the park's murals constantly changing. So every six to eight months, we will be selecting a new artist to create a design. And um, we'll be reaching out to you guys for your response and for your input. Helping to keep the art in the Arts District. In downtown L.A., I'm Gil Reyes for L.A. This Week. The Half Acre Park sits on 5th and Hewitt Streets next to the Earth Cafe.